sacred place called Kukaniloko. Kukaniloko houses the birthing stones of many of Oahu Island kings and queens. And this chant celebrates the legacy of those special, significant rocks. No Kukaniloko Ku Aloha, originally appearing in the Hawaiian language newspaper Ku in May of 1925. Kaluoko was once owned by King Kamehameha the Great and then passed on to a future king, William Charles of Lunalilo. 
At his death, his property then was passed on to our beloved queen, Queen Emma. Much of Waikiki was significant as a place of rest and relaxation for a lot of royalty in Hawaii. Cool breezes and wonderful springs. And it was intended for the queen to enjoy the space with her family. And yet sadly, at the tender age of four, she lost her son. And Hawaii lost its hope in the future of a king. In the passing of young Prince Albert Kaui Kiaoli. A grieving mother she was, she created a name. She called herself Kalaleo Kalani, the flight of the royal one. And then, just 15 months later, our queen lost her husband, and Hawaii lost its king in the passing of Kamehameha IV. Oh, still grieving the passing of her son. She took the name that she gave herself, Kalaleo Kalani, and modified it to Kalaleo Nalani, the flight of the royal ones. It was her strength, and it was the love and support and aloha from her people that helped her through such difficult times. Ma Coco.